What's up there people? Yes, it's Danny from Budget Mods back again. Yes, it's been a few weeks. It's been about a month and a half since I've done a video. Um, it's been busy, it's been tough, it's been this, that, the other. Um, so I'm going to show you what I've been up to uh, since the last video, which was the exhaust. Um, as you can see... I have tinted the back three windows. Yes, it's not very good. It's my first time. Um, I did try and do a video on this, um, but I wanted to try and... I've done it a couple of times. It's not the first time. It's just like the first couple of times that I've done this. So, they're not bad, but it is bad. It's terrible. It, it's absolutely terrible. Don't forget, I'm not a window tinter, so it's just one of those. So I have tried, I'm trying my best. I am going to order some more film um, to give it another go. Um, I've got enough to do the back window again because that is shocking. Turn that round. If you can see up there, you can see all the creases in it and stuff. Uh, that one, it's ripped down there. And this one. That ain't too bad, but there's a couple of imperfections, and so it's not 100%. But I'm giving it a go. You know what I mean? I'm not going to say that I'm perfect and stuff like that, because I'm not. It's one of them. Not going to be perfect. It's just how it is. Um, so let's just go through the modifications that I have done to this vehicle. Um, page... The lovely 307cc. Um, as a family, we decided to name a page. So, to start off with, what I did start with is the steering wheel cover and obviously the seat belt, whatever you want to call them. Then we went on to painting. Well, we did those first and I painted them myself. You got them all down here and over here I do need to get this done and these two bits which I have down there we've also had a new gear knob um, we've had that a couple of weeks now uh, it just shortens it a little bit so it makes it a little bit easier to shift uh, well, so we've, well we've painted that as well uh, we've had the LED strips underneath there and we have got them back there as well, as you can see. Uh, we've had some new car mats put in. Bought them. There was like four ninety nine and stuff. So that's near enough the whole like interior of the car. Um, and obviously we've done the window tinting. Yes, it's not one hundred percent, but I'm going to give it another go. Um, it's it's not an easy job. It's not. I've been told it's not an easy job, but it's a skill that I want to learn. That's the best part about it. Uh, so what we're going to do is go on to the outside and have a look around, and uh, I'll probably do a voiceover or something for for that bit, um, just to show you what I've done on the outside of the car. So come on. So first off, we actually put these on, which are the new indicators. Uh, so the strobed, uh, yeah, obviously the sun strip on there with the budget mods, the lovely, lovely uh, spoiler that I put on. I think it just really makes the car look a bit more sporty. Once again, we have a bit of budget mods on there. Also, we've got the big tailpipe. Uh, that box of later, see if we can get you underneath there. So, the back box of later was a, a must to be honest. Let's get underneath here. Let's and we've got the induction kit as well. 
So yeah, got all that. So that's all of what I've done so far, and and I've still got that them stickers down there as well. Sorry, I have got them stickers down there as well. <laughs> Covered that oh, well. Um, there's a lot to do on this car, boys and girls, but it's having the time, it's having the money, it's, it's the body work now more than anything, I'm trying to get the paint right and stuff, I'll show you what I mean. So, I have tried to cover some of this up and you can see that, I need to buff it all down and try and get it all right, same, this is an a next job as well oh, I've also blacked out all the badges as well but this is the next job changing all this getting these painted as well got some scuffs here this is before I had the car but all this has got to be redone and try and get it painted or try and get something to you know get it a bit nicer these are gonna be sorted as well. This is before I had the car. So, try to sand them down or something, get them painted black. Uh, the wheel hub's gotta be done on this, so it might be that. Once again, some more deep scratches on there. On the boots here, there's a lovely scratch. I have got some paint, but because the car is 16 years old, it's just one of them. Once again, painted them on the back. Got to try and get this glue off. Once again, more scratches on here. Uh, let's get back in the car. Oh, like I said, there's a lot to do. Absolutely loads to do on the car. Trying to get the paintwork sorted. I've got bits of it done, I've got the small scratches and the swirls and stuff because I bought one of them uh, electric polishers. Got some of the smaller scratches out, but the large scratches, I don't know what to do. Um, I'm thinking, I want to paint the roof black on the outside uh, or wrap it black, I'm not 100% sure. I might just paint it so it's more permanent. Um, and I'm thinking about a drip. Uh, paint work sort of thing so it goes to, like hide some of the scratches I'm not 100% sure it was like a flick I'd like, put some put some gloves on to do some flecks of black paint all over it I'm not 100% sure what to do um, if anybody out there can help me with trying to get some of these scratches out or so, what not um, you know because it's the, the paint work is 16 years old it's a little bit harder I'll say a little bit harder, it's a lot harder um, to do. So, yeah, that's about it, uh, guys. All the, I saw the modifications that we've done, so let's top it off. So we've got the induction kit, we've done all the interior bits and stuff with the LED lights, the painting of the dashboard bits and stuff. We've got the spoiler, tinting of the wi windows, which I am going to do again, um, just so I can, I've got that skill. Um, we've got the back box delete, the car sounds mint, uh, the induction kit, the blinkers, um, I've got to restore the headlights on it as well, um, try to sand them down and polish them and stuff like that, try to get them back up to a reasonable standard, reasonable standard, uh, is there anything else? Trying to get the interior back up because there is like marks in the interior that I'm not happy with. Um, I want to try and get some plastic restore and stuff and try and get it back to back to its glory, but with a few modifications. Because um, it's a good running car, it passes MOT with no um, exceptions or anything like that. You know, and I love this car, I really do. I want to try and keep it as, as long as I can. I really do. There is a few things I'll, 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 I'll like uh, to do. So changing the analog uh, dashboard, 
to something else or the more digital version but it costs money um i need to put the dash cam back up as well and get that plumbed in properly you know it's just one of them and what else is there um and just the paintwork the bodywork trying to get that sorted because other than that this is an absolute sound car it really is everything lines up as it should everything's just nice everything's still straight yes there's a few dinks a few scratches and stuff before i had the car i will put that out there there is a couple on there that i have had don't forget I, I'm, I'm, i've been driving them less than a year so again just getting that sorted um i just want somebody to help me out with this if anyone can other than that guys that is it from me today thank you very much for joining me and watch out for the next video which will be the grill the wheel hub and maybe painting the wheels other than that guys thank you very much for joining me and i will catch you on the next video don't forget to like and subscribe catch you in a bit